Hey dudes and welcome back to another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set defaults on DVD Styler. So if you want uh, DVD Styler to do uh, uh, a set of defaults, we're going to go configuration and settings. So we basically you can change the language of DVD Styler if you want to, but I'm going to set it on English. English. <laughs> on default disc label to be DVD. And this capacity will always be DVD5, but I want the video format to be NTSC since I live in that region and the NTSC regions. And I want 16x9 because all of my videos are in 16x9 format. Also, I can change the audio format if I want to be 5.1 surround sound or I want to normalize the audio, especially if you have bad audio on your videos. So, uh, yeah. Also, next is uh, chap default chapter length and how uh, long each chapter you want, especially if you have long videos, I would suggest uh, having this set on. If you want to chop it up into chapters, especially if you have a one hour video to put on DVD, I usually go for 15 minutes rather than uh, 10 minutes. The next is the default title post command, which is basically what happens after you uh, played a video or just, just played a title, as you can see the title. After that title, will it call the last menu it was in, the button it was in, call the root menu, which is the first menu, or the play the next title means it will play the next video or the next title after that title. It sounds confusing, somehow it is, but uh, bear with me. So the next one is a default button. If you want uh, the default button is you drag the title to the preview. I will always choose frame, but it can we can also choose um, arrow, text, arrow to left, red arrow, or pill, whatever you want. But I prefer using the frame because I like the frame things. So uh, next is the default slide trans duration, which is Basically, you can make uh, slideshows in DVD Styler, and this is how long each uh, picture will last. The next one is the default transition duration, is how long the transition would commence. The next one is uh, the default slide transition, which is the default uh, transition for the s slideshow that you want. I'm using I will somehow go in fade and fade out, so I'm not gonna change it. Click OK to that, and now you're ready to uh, make DVDs. So anyways, dudes, I'm New Creator, see you later.